the day. The other one was another top 10 matchup, Wisconsin and Nebraska. Would there be another upset here? It was the reunion from 20 years ago when they won their 1997 national championship. First quarter, Tanner Lee throws it. It bounces off of the helmet of Divino Zigbo, and Chris Orr has it, and he's chugging along. Fairly decent attempt from Tanner Lee there, but not really. That's a bad route run by Zigbo here. That's a bad route. And a heck of a catch and concentration from Chris Orr. Taking it all the way, and that's your first score of the day. Tanner Lee, a little later on, near the end of the half, with some really nice protection. Plenty of time to throw to the right side, and he finds Stanley Morgan Jr., and he is going all the way for the score. And just like that, a 10-0 big, easy first half for Wisconsin is a three-point game. Momentum is on Nebraska's side until the very next play, Chuck, mm. when Jonathan Taylor does this. Well, Jonathan Taylor behind that big offensive line can't be stopped tonight, 249 yards rushing. You see the big play there. They're not going to catch him. Jonathan Taylor roars like Simba for a 75-yard score, and the Badgers go back up 10 at the break. Third quarter, Alex Hornibrook dropping back, flings it to the wrong guy. Aaron Williams brings it back for a score, and just like that, the home crowd going nuts. We're tied at 17. A little bit later on, Wisconsin drives down Hornibrook to Quintez Cephas. The nice catch. The Badgers take the lead back. Fourth quarter, more of the man of the day. That's Jonathan Taylor. He was re remarkable. Just remarkable on the day. We're talking 249 yards on the ground. It's a good this day. true freshman Ooh. just ran for 249 on the road in Lincoln, Nebraska. Lisa Byington was at the game, and she caught up with the star freshman running back. Jonathan Taylor, what keeps getting easier for you as the weeks go on? Uh, you know, I just think, think the run fits get easier. You know, going every day at practice, working with the O-line, uh, you know, making sure we're all on the same page. And, uh, you know, they know where they're blocking their guys. You know, they're telling me, you know, where they're going to try to get the run fits going. And uh, you know, I think it's just that communication between us. The ground attack, especially in the second half, was very workmanlike and very effective. What kind of attitude did you as an offense have to take? Uh, you know, we had to take a... a you know, a real strong attitude, you know, say, we're going to show these guys, you know, we're, we're the most physical team here. You know, that's one thing we pride ourselves on, being one of the most physical groups in the country. So, you know, we came out the second half, you know, try to try to display that. You ended the first half with an impressive touchdown run. What did you see from your perspective? Uh, you know, from my perspective, uh, no momentum shift. Uh, so, you know, going into the half, you know, tried to, Try to make sure that, you know, I try to shift the momentum our way, you know, talk to the O-line. You know, we got, we talked about where the run fits were going to be, you know. You know, we worked together. Communication was great and it was there. All right. Thank you for the time. Thank you so much.